Once upon a time, in the ancient Chinese lands, there lived a humble bamboo cutter named Wang. Wang was a dedicated man, his heart and soul intertwined with the art of bamboo cutting. The rising sun would find him in the forests, his hands skillfully maneuvering the bamboo sticks, and the setting sun would leave him still immersed in his craft. Wang's work was his life, and his life was his work. But while Wang was mastering his craft, he was unknowingly neglecting an equally important part of his life, his family. His wife waited for him at home, his children yearned for his presence, and his friends missed his company. The bamboo forest had become his world, and the rest of his life was left untouched, like a book unopened. His obsession with work started taking a toll on him. His body grew weary, his mind became restless, and his heart filled with a strange emptiness. He was successful in his work, but was he successful in life? This question haunted Wang. One day, as he sat alone in the forest, exhausted and dissatisfied, he realized his mistake. He had been so engrossed in his work that he had forgotten to live. He had forgotten the joy of a shared meal with his family, the laughter of his children, the comfort of a friend's company. He had been living a half-life. This revelation was a turning point for Wang. He decided to make a change, to find a balance between his work and personal life. And while it wasn't easy, he was determined to make it work. He started spending time with his family, enjoying the simple pleasures of life, and found that his work did not suffer, but instead, it thrived. He was happier, healthier, and more fulfilled. In the end, Wang learned the hard way that all work and no play could lead to an unfulfilled life. His tale serves as a timeless reminder of the importance of finding a balance between work and personal life, a concept that holds as much relevance today as it did in the times of ancient China. The tale of Wang is not just a fable, it mirrors the lives of many in our fast-paced world. Now let's delve into the science behind work-life balance. Studies and research have consistently shown that a lack of balance between work and personal life can lead to significant negative effects. One of these is health issues, According to the American Psychological Association, those who struggle with work-life balance are more prone to chronic stress, which can lead to a host of health problems, including heart disease, digestive issues, and mental health disorders like depression and anxiety. Relationship problems are another consequence of work-life imbalance. The British Psychological Society found that individuals who dedicate excessive time to their jobs often struggle to maintain healthy relationships. They may find themselves missing out on important family events or not having enough time for their partners or children. This can lead to feelings of guilt, strain in relationships, and ultimately a decrease in life satisfaction. Let's not forget about productivity. Contrary to what some might think, working longer hours doesn't necessarily mean getting more done. The Organization for Economic Cooperation and Development has found that countries with longer work hours often have lower productivity levels. This is because chronic stress and burnout can lead to decreased cognitive function, making it harder to concentrate, make decisions, and think creatively. And it's not just about the individual. A study by Harvard Business Review found that companies with cultures that promote work-life balance have higher employee engagement, lower turnover, and better overall performance. So you see, achieving a healthy work-life balance is not just about having time for leisure or family, it's about preventing serious health issues, maintaining strong relationships, and even being more productive at work. As the science shows, work-life balance isn't just about living a good life, it's about living a healthy life. Work-life balance begins with setting boundaries. Let's imagine for a moment, life as an intricate dance, a ballet perhaps. Each dancer represents a different part of your life, work, family, hobbies, and self-care. Now, if one dancer begins to dominate the stage, the harmony is lost, and the dance becomes chaotic. This is exactly what happens when we don't set boundaries between different aspects of our lives. Boundaries are essential. They are the invisible lines that we draw to keep different aspects of our lives in their rightful place. They ensure that no single dancer dominates the stage and that the ballet of life maintains its harmony. Research from the American Psychological Association suggests that setting boundaries can significantly reduce stress and improve well-being. A 2017 study discovered that employees who set clear boundaries between their work and personal lives were less likely to experience emotional exhaustion, a key symptom of burnout. Now, 
Setting boundaries doesn't mean shutting out work completely once you step out of the office. It's about creating a balance that works for you. It's about deciding when you will work and when you will engage in personal activities and then sticking to that decision. For example, you might decide that you won't check work emails after seven in the evening or that you'll dedicate the first hour of your day to a personal activity like exercise or meditation. These boundaries, though seemingly small, can have a profound impact on your stress levels and overall well-being. And remember, setting boundaries is not a sign of weakness or lack of dedication. It's a necessary step towards achieving a healthy work-life balance. It's about respecting your time and ensuring that each aspect of your life gets the attention it deserves. So don't be afraid to draw those lines, to assert your boundaries, to say no when you need to. It's not about being rigid. It's about creating a flexible framework that allows for a balanced, fulfilling life. Remember, boundaries are not walls, but guidelines for a balanced life. Managing time effectively is a crucial step towards achieving work-life balance. This isn't just a catchy phrase, it's a fundamental truth. Each of us has the same 24 hours in a day, but how we use those hours determines the quality of our lives. Time management strategies are essential tools for maintaining balance. One such strategy is the Eisenhower Matrix, named after US President Dwight D. Eisenhower. This method involves dividing tasks into four categories, important and urgent, important but not urgent, not important but urgent, and not important and not urgent. By categorizing tasks this way, we can prioritize effectively and avoid unnecessary stress. Another strategy is the Pomodoro Technique, created by Francesco Cirillo in the late 80s. This method involves breaking work into 25-minute intervals, separated by short five-minute breaks. These frequent breaks can improve mental agility and keep your mind fresh and focused. However, time management is just one piece of the puzzle. Self-care is equally important. It's not a luxury, but a necessity for mental, physical and emotional well-being. This includes anything that refuels us rather than takes from us. It could be as simple as taking a walk, reading a book, meditating or even taking a power nap. Studies have shown that self-care activities can improve productivity and personal satisfaction. According to a study published in the Journal of Occupational and Environmental Medicine, employees who participate in regular self-care activities are more productive, have lower stress levels and are less likely to leave their jobs. In essence, both time management and self-care are vital components of a balanced life. They enable us to work effectively while ensuring we have time for ourselves and our loved ones. They help us to maintain our physical and mental health, and they ensure we have the energy and focus to meet our professional and personal goals. Time once lost can never be regained. Use it wisely. Remember, time management and self-care are not about squeezing as many tasks into your day as possible. It's about simplifying how you work, doing things faster and relieving stress. It's about making time for you. Because in the end, it's not about being busy, it's about being effective. Achieving work-life balance isn't just an individual responsibility. Employers play a significant role too. As we delve into this scene, let's examine how employers can foster a culture that values and supports work-life balance. Firstly, flexible work arrangements. In the 21st century, the traditional nine to five workday is becoming increasingly outdated. Employers can encourage work-life balance by offering options such as remote work, flexible hours, or compressed work weeks. According to a study by the International Workplace Group, 80% of workers would choose a job that offered flexible working over one that didn't. This shows that flexibility isn't just a perk, it's a necessity for modern workers. Next, supportive policies. These can range from paid time off to parental leave to wellness programs. It's not enough to just have these policies in place, they need to be encouraged and utilized. A study by the Society for Human Resource Management found that companies with strong health and wellness programs outperform others on the S&P 500 index by a staggering 7%. This means that supportive policies aren't just good for employees, they're good for business. Finally, a positive work culture. This is perhaps the most nebulous yet critical aspect of promoting work-life balance. A culture that values well-being and balance over endless work hours can significantly reduce stress and burnout. Employers can foster this culture by leading by example, encouraging breaks, praising efficiency over long hours, and promoting open dialogue about work-life balance. Research by the Corporate Executive Board, 
which represents 70% of the Fortune 500 companies, found that employees who believe that their employers are concerned about their well-being are nearly 90% more likely to go the extra mile at work. In conclusion, employers have a tremendous role to play in promoting work-life balance. Flexible work arrangements, supportive policies and a positive work culture are all key components of this. A supportive employer doesn't just lead to happier employees, but also a more successful business. Achieving work-life balance may seem daunting, but it's not impossible. It's about making choices that serve your values and priorities. One of the key steps towards achieving this balance is to prioritise tasks. Picture your to-do list as a pyramid. At the top, you have your most important tasks, the ones that align with your long-term goals and values. These could be anything from spending quality time with your family to working on a career-changing project. These tasks should take precedence over the ones lower down the pyramid. The next level could include tasks that are important but not urgent. These might include activities that contribute to your personal growth and well-being, such as reading a book or going for a run. Allocate time for these activities in your schedule, but ensure they don't overshadow your top priorities. At the bottom of the pyramid are tasks that are neither urgent nor important. These are the tasks that often consume our time without adding much value. Learn to delegate these tasks, or even eliminate them if possible. Delegation is another vital tool for achieving work-life balance. It's about recognising that you don't have to do everything yourself. Whether it's at work or home, delegate tasks to others who have the skills and the time. This not only frees up your time, but also empowers others to grow and develop. Lastly, make time for hobbies and relaxation. These activities are often the first to be sacrificed when we're busy, but they're crucial for our mental and physical well-being. Whether it's painting, playing an instrument, or simply taking a walk in the park, these activities help us unwind and recharge. Don't forget to unplug and disconnect from work during these times. This helps to create a clear boundary between work and personal life, allowing you to fully engage in the moment. Remember, balance is not about perfection, but about making choices that align with your values. So take a step back, assess your priorities, and start making conscious choices that lead towards a more balanced and fulfilling life. At M Yoga Coaching and Consulting, we understand the challenges of striking a balance. In the contemporary world, where the boundaries between personal and professional lives are increasingly blurring, finding equilibrium can seem like a monumental task. But fear not, because at M Yoga, we have made it our mission to help you navigate this complex maze. Our philosophy is simple. We believe that work-life balance is not a luxury, but a necessity. It's not just about time management, it's about life management. It's about creating a harmonious blend of work, relationships, relaxation and personal growth. Now you might be wondering, how can we help you achieve this elusive balance? The answer lies in our unique approach. We don't offer one-size-fits-all solutions. Instead, we provide personalised coaching and consulting services tailored to your specific needs and challenges. We equip you with practical strategies to set boundaries, manage time effectively, prioritise personal activities and practise self-care. But more importantly, we help you redefine success beyond just career achievements and financial rewards. One key feature of our service is the complimentary career breakthrough call. This is a golden opportunity for you to discuss your career aspirations, challenges and concerns with our experienced coaches. We'll help you identify the obstacles hindering your work-life balance and devise an action plan to overcome them. The benefits of this call are manifold. It's a chance for you to gain valuable insights into your career trajectory, understand the impact of your work habits on your personal life and discover effective strategies to create a healthier, more fulfilling lifestyle. It's a step towards self-awareness, empowerment and transformation. Remember, work-life balance is not a destination, but a journey. It's about making small, consistent changes in your daily routine, mindset and habits. And we at M Yoga are committed to guiding you on this journey every step of the way. With M Yoga, you're not alone in your journey towards a balanced life. So why wait? Start your journey today. Book your complimentary career breakthrough call with M Yoga Coaching and Consulting. Let us help you create the balance you deserve. Let's take a quick stroll down memory lane and revisit what we've learned today.
Our journey began with the enchanting tale of the bamboo cutter, an ancient Chinese mythology that highlighted the importance of balance in life. And much like how the bamboo cutter found harmony in his endeavors, it's crucial we do the same with our work and personal life. We dived into the science behind work-life balance, understanding its significance in today's fast-paced world. The lines between our professional and personal lives can easily blur, causing increased stress, burnout and dissatisfaction. Hence, achieving a healthy balance is not just beneficial but essential for our overall well-being. Setting boundaries emerged as a key strategy to maintaining this balance. By defining clear limits between our work and personal life, we can ensure that neither aspect is neglected. We also delved into the importance of effective time management and self-care practices, both of which play a vital role in maintaining harmony in our lives. The role of employers in promoting work-life balance was another crucial point of discussion. Flexible work arrangements, supportive policies, and a culture that values well-being are all integral to fostering a balanced work environment. No one should have to sacrifice their personal time for career advancement, and employers play a significant role in ensuring this. We also explored practical tips for achieving work-life balance. These included prioritizing personal activities, practicing self-care and setting boundaries. Remember, it's not about having it all, but rather enjoying what you have. And finally, we introduced the M Yoga Way, our unique approach to coaching and consulting that prioritizes your needs and helps you strike the perfect balance between your career and personal life. As the ancient Chinese tale of Wang teaches us, balance is the key to a fulfilled life. So why wait? Book your complimentary career breakthrough call with M Yoga Coaching and Consulting today.